All right, welcome to episode zero of uh, the Second Act Band Practice. Uh, my name is Justin D. O'Brien uh, of JD and the Second Act, um, and this is going to be our podcast. Like I said, this is episode zero. Uh, I hope to have lots of guests, talk lots of music, talk lots of life, because life leaks into band practice and into music and vice versa. So um, we'll talk about how that both ways affects everything. Um, I was going to play something else, but now, you know, of course, as it happens, uh, something else popped in my brain, and now i got to do it. So bear with me here for a second. Jump on the old information superhighway. No, I'm not going to download the app. Um, let's turn this up, make sure... That's working. Go away. Where's the others? There. There's a reader view. Interesting. Oh, what's going on? I don't get it. There. Cool song though. All right, let's let's go back to what I was going to do. All right. <clears throat> You 
stupid free when looking at me. You're not like me. You blue hair freak. I push you down. I didn't push you around. Cause I'm the head of the class. And I'm gonna make your ass run away from me. You got him free. Right on. Um, oh, let's see. That's a good one. Especially on this guitar. Especially on this guitar. Let's see here. Um, there. No, you can stuck on again. Um, I was playing that song. I was playing those songs, I should say, because a little bit here and there. Um, hmm. Cancel. I guess I can't do... Uh, well, whatever. Um, and I was thinking uh, something I want to say between, uh, before I play this next song. Um, I want to talk about this guitar I'm playing. This is, uh, nickname is the uh, Heart of Gold. Uh, it's a Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy reference. Um, and also because it, well, when I, it was, when I got it, it was a little bit, you know, hardware was a little bit more gold, kind of like it is up here. But uh, um very, very good guitar. I've had it for a long time. It's This is the E guitar that stays in tune no matter what I do to it. Uh, tune it up, tune it down, do whatever I want to. It has EMGs. Um, I did myself. It's a volume, volume, so it's volume here, volume here. Um, and that's really about it. And it's just, it's a workhorse and it's a great guitar. So uh, EMG and ESP, thanks a lot for the great stuff. Um, <clears throat> This is a cover. I've been liking this song. Now we ride, ride around. Now we sail a real song. Down. Oh, yeah. You wreck me, baby. You break me in two. But you move me, honey. Yes, you do. Now and again, I get the feeling if I don't win, I'm gonna break even. Rescue me Should I go wrong If I dig too deep If I stay too long Oh Yeah You wreck me honey You break me in two Will you move me baby Yes you do Honey 
You break me in two You move me, baby Yes, you do You wreck me, honey Break me in two But you move me, darling Yes, you do Excuse me. Cheers. So, I started playing that Petty song because um, um, the uh, documentary that's on Netflix, uh, yeah, look it up. I'm not going to, everyone should just go watch it anyway, so, um, all right. Oh, that's not complete. Oh, that's not the right. Here we go. Oh, maybe I'll get to my other Tom Betty cover later. <clears throat> if I have enough liquid. All right. <clears throat> um, like I said, this tar season tune really well. This is original. It's called uh, Mistakes. Flew like water, the blood is red. Santa slashed, misunderstand. Sirens flashing, six feet of dirt. Life in jail, can you misunderstand?
This one's called the 27 Club. <clears throat> 27. Tortured soul. So young and yet so old. Oh, you burn. Oh, so bright. The darkest sun to ever shine. Adventure or at the crossroads with Bobby McGee. Band of gypsies, Mr. Mojo Rising, heart shaped box, and back to black. sidetrack but do I have a uh, let me uh... turn off the click go away Mr. Metronome oh <sighs> This one's called Road to Asphalt. It's about uh, the nerve ergering and racing cars. <laughs> Yet that was the destroyer.
distraction on the way to... Oh, and that's another distraction. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez, distractions. Oh, wait. Well, now I am missing songs. Oh, there it is. Aha. Aha. All right. This is my song um, inspired by Neil deGrasse Tyson and a friend of his. Um, I forgot his friend's name, but I do have it written down. Um, uh, uh, but this is... Um, I think it explains itself, but the name of the uh, song is called Bottle of Wine at the End of the World. Let's try it this way. Which is, why I said I got distracted is because that's another song that's been influenced by Neil deGrasse Tyson uh, on Joe Rogan again. So he said everything's uh, with the universe. Sometimes it just feels like everything just gets bigger and bigger. And sometimes when you go down, it just keeps getting smaller and smaller, you know, with um, um, atoms and neutrinos and quarks and, and, and sub subatomic particles and all that and, and nuons and gluons and blah 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 when you go down 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 and then when you go up you know it's the planet and the solar system and the galaxy and the universes and the multiverses and it's a big you know what can we see and what can we theoretically think exists and it just goes on and on and on infinitely fractally and that's the name of the song Ever expanding, ever the same, the same patterns. Oh, 
only one Never unique Never a mistake A message in the pattern Infinitely Good night, party people. That was a good time.